Hello! Welcome back to Help Me Please! Uh, we're taking out Resident Evil 3, the remake. Uh, what did I play on the demo? I really liked. I did not, honestly, I did not expect the game to start with a live action cutscene when I first started. I was like, this is a little weird. Yeah, as humans, we are so good at writing. Animals don't know how to do this. Imagine a gorilla writing. You can't. There's Martin Scarelli. I love that they got like a look-alike for it. Hmm, yes. Science. this foundation that will continue to build a brighter future for all of us. I hate this scene kind of because it reminds me a lot of um, the movies. Like, I don't know, it just kind of looks goofy. They could have just got the costume from the second movie. The one where Nemesis cared. What an awful like movie franchise! It somehow made so much, made so much money. It made so many of them. Oh, Nemesis! What a surprise! Is that Eris? <laughs> Kinda looks like Eva too from uh, Metal Gear Solid 3. And we're now in Resident Evil 7. I like your boots, Jill. Got some pills over there. See? Look at it. Actually, it looks a lot like Paws. Jill has a lot of half naked girls on her wall. That's cool. I don't know what any of this is. Take a little more time looking. So, sadly, this had to be re. Did I close this? Oh, I didn't do this the first time. I had to redo the first episode because for some reason it got corrupted. But, so i kind of already been a little bit into this game. So I'm sure there's a lot of easter eggs. You should probably just look at this. So, a little bit, like, once we get to, like, kind of where the demo started. Is where about I was, but, I don't know, it kind of, kind of sucks to restart. Because I kind of like the, I'm sure, like, the actual genuine, like, first reveal. That was amazing. This looks cool. I love how this looks. It's kind of cool to see Jill in first person. So yeah, I'm just gonna go to I about where I recorded my second recording will start, and then hopefully, and then from then on, just upload the rest. Jill, don't. You look beautiful, Jill. Don't, don't fall to the standards of. What the beauty industry tells you. You look good, girl. I feel like this is the different. Listen, that's how everyone looks when they wake up. I feel bad. No, oh, Jill! You're like the best character Resident Evil's made! Worst month. I love that she wrote that down. Worst month of my life. It gets worse every night. Like she had to make sure. More days, then I can kiss this town goodbye. I guess I also miss like just do flavor texting horror games. I feel like I honestly kind of like the point. I could kind of miss old school horror games. We just got scared and did puzzles.
Uh, let the sink on. That pill's gonna be so much. He's turning this whole zombie park when she saw running water. Yeah, at first I didn't like the new design, but the more I'm like looking at it, the more I really like it actually. Like a little bit like a little bit Tomb Raider esque. Like the 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 new one. The reimagining. Those are some tiny oh, those for towels maybe? Those are tiny. You can't put clothes in there, Jill. Wonder who it is. All right, I'm coming. Yeah, tell the phone. Hello. Jill, are you, are you okay? Brad, is that you? Listen, you gotta hey, Brad. Get out of there. What are you talking about? I don't have time to explain. You gotta get out of there right now. All right, let me grab my. Ah! Jesus, I kind of maybe jump again. <laughs> this is actually like really cool. I'll see. Chill, just. Oof. Ah! Run, Jill! Okay, let's go. Run, 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 run. I don't even know where he pulled that from. All right. He busted through a wall, Jill. You think that's really gonna stop him? Just and it's like she napped through all this. It just went to hell in like one second. What happened? Sorry, buddy. I'll try to go save you. Hey, nemesis. Can we just be pals? Alright, you got some creepy tentacles. Okay, okay, okay. Nemesis, you got some moves. You got some OTGs. But you don't got a running ability. I got the Oh Jesus. Okay. Oh my I actually did forget that. I was like, kick the ladder down. This place has a terrible fire alarm system. Nothing's happening. Oh my god. It looks cool. But this guy's. I kind of. What an idiot. Got yourself stuck in there. Always go towards the liquor stores in any emergency. Just get liquored up. Because then if you do anything you regret, you can just be like, I was drunk. Brad. And that always makes it better. Brad, I missed you. What was that thing? Damn if I know. But right now it's got a hard on for the only two stars left in town. You and me. I'm not sticking around. Just look around you. The longer we wait, the more screwed we are. You're kind of right, Brad. Brad, can I have your white gloves? This all happened so fast. I don't know. <laughs> One fucked up thing always leads to another. It's like our clay on steroids. <laughs> Tommy, that's that's kind of true. Is that Captain Commando? Hey, what his name is? Brad, I don't even know why you were just standing there. Brad, I also told you never call me back after you left me the first time. You left all of us, you coward. 
<gasps> That's Morgan! There's Morgan on the door! Or the, the side. The Brad. Oh. I like, don't think about it. Brad is... Brad, I love you now. Like, you were such a... Chicken, you're such a hero now. I love that they actually fleshed that out a little bit, like... Sorry. A little more of a hero. So the guy who just gets impaled in the head. Oh, uh, you want a tango, buddy? Alright, got one bullet. Oh, we got no bullets. Nice little, uh... Hey, go where these arrows are. I didn't even notice there was someone on the bus the first time. Officer, what were you even doing there? You look a little too old. Alright, down the hall. Alright, parking garage roof. This loser still here. I wonder if I could go up there. Well, see ya, sir. See ya, he's still a coward. You, sir, you're just in a stupid box. Wow, sir! What a jerk! I didn't do this the first time. That honestly sounds way worse. Like, you're just sitting here for a while, just slowly dying, or get killed basically instantly. Like, yeah, that's... Doesn't like I'd rather get banned. Oh, hey, Pooch. Do, do, do. Follow the gerbils. Oh, God. Oh my goodness. I, I like those zombie designs right there because they kind of look like the first game, like the very first one you see. Let's go. Got it again. Stupid elevators never being working right. Honestly, elevators are just a nuisance to society. We should never have them. Okay. Oh, she's got a little two gun holsters. In fact, I never noticed. Hey, I'm on my way. I'm sure nothing bad will ever happen to a helicopter. Oh, I don't know what he did. They throw something? I don't know what they actually did right there. Let's go. Come on, come on, come on. He looks like the juggernaut from Deadpool 2. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Like a spoiler. If you haven't seen it, I'm sorry. It's my turn, bitch. Let's go. Oh. 
from the top rope! Oh, he literally killed him in half! And that's the end of Nemesis. You wish. Oh my god. Oh. Okay, see, that looks so cool and terrifying. He's just like... I can't- I still can't believe he just catches it! <laughs> Grab the arm, Carlos, let's go! Hey, easy, buddy, I got you. Who are you? What do you do? It's Carlos. I'm saving you. Come on, let's get you someplace safe. They lived happily ever after. Made lots of little babies. You wish. I think we're in the clear. That is where the demo starts right here. We've been bringing survivors here. Here where? My guys have converted some subway cars into a shelter. It's safe. I'm fine. Personal space. Okay, I get it. Let's go. Oh, come on. Who's the dipshit that closed this? Sorry, we're gonna. It probably was you, Carlos. You seem like the type to forget. Nothing. I've never seen anything like it. But it's no zombie. It knows what it wants and won't stop till it gets it. Don't you like that in a man? Oh, goodness. He's all yours. Seriously, Carlos, number one fuckboy of all time. I promise you're in good hands. I'm with the Umbrella Biohazard Countermeasure Service. BBCS for short. Are you kidding me? Are you fucking kidding me? You guys are the ones who caused all of this. Whoa, 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 whoa. What are you talking about? Uh. You don't have to trust me, but I'm going to the shelter. You coming? Carlos, Carlos, Carlos. It's this way. Dino Bites. I think those are see Bubble Bobble. Dr. Wiley. <laughs> hey, Captain. This fine young lady could use our help. Yes, I do. Like the beret. Carlos, you didn't even think to ask fine young lady your name. She is an elite operative of RPD, Special Tactics and Rescue Service. Her name is something Valentine. Foray Valentine. Jill. Oh, sorry, Jill. Nice to meet you. I suppose you can't recognize you without my beret. Should be beret buddies. BCS, platoon leader Mikhail Victor. My team was sent here to rescue civilians. Right. How's that going for you? The city is completely cut off, isolated. Most of the hundred thousand civilians will wind up dead. Uh, correction, undead. Hmm. My platoon has suffered serious losses. Just keeping them alive is more than I can manage. Well, you can thank your corporate overlords for that. Yes. Well, we are doing all we can. If we can get this subway train I feel like Mikhail didn't fight too hard right there because he kind of knows. But we need help. My men cannot do this alone. Alright, that one already lost the rocket launcher. Alright. I'm in. But I am on their side. Not yours. Oh, hey. It's cool. We all want the same thing. Thank you, Jill. All right, super cop. Here you go. We can use this to stay in contact. 
I know what a radio is. So, uh, I thought you said that. Like, jeez, that's a little rude, Jill. You need to get you geared up. Head up to street level. You'll find supplies there. Right. Ammo crafting. Same as a uh, Res Evil Two. Also, probably gonna try to read most of these notes. Cause they're pretty interesting. But it's always fun to read stuff like this. In the gray of the morning on September 25th, a frantic caller telephoned the RPD to report an assault. A man described as disheveled like a vagrant was attacking a passerby north of the Lambs Museum of Art. The responding officers discovered the mutilated corpse of a woman by some dumpster nearby. Dozens of bite marks covered her body and she had been dismembered, suggesting she had been eating. Eden. The third known incident of this kind occurred in Raccoon City this month. So, who done it? Who's been munching on man steak? Oh my goodness. We're here at News Comment. I have a gnawing feeling. Oh, this guy really went for it. Gnawing feeling that the so called cannibal disease patient Spencer Memorial has been provided free treatment for since August might not be selling for just the cafeteria food. Our reporters that infiltrated Spencer Memorial after the tough, asked the tough questions came back with horror stories that would make your stomach roll. Turn the page for the scoop. Turn it, Jill. I was on the edge of my seat. They killed him. Deep kiss, crew. Eric the Dragon Slayer. I kind of wish it just be in a pop of beans. That looks horrible. I guess just mint candy. Might as well just put toothpaste. Apricot like gummy. Stumps? Those sound awesome. Give me a pile of stumps. Right next to my whoopers. It's me again. You topside yet? Working on it. So what's the plan? The old tanks got me clearing the tracks. You might get in the subway infrastructure back online. And how do I do that? Let's start by restoring power. I'll navigate you to the substation once you hit the main road. Copy that. Let's do this fast. Alright, crab. Oh, wrong thing. There's some good old coo Actually, I messed up. Hey, you know what? I'm doing it differently, but it was a little bit matter. That I opened this. I'm a little sad that this isn't a puzzle puzzle now. It almost like, looks like I can get this working if I plug in the right whatever it is. I just like how she like cares about this random thing that's just there. Like why do you want it to work, Jill? Let's do the speedrun strat. Let's go. Woo! Just run past them. Alright. This is actually going a little better than my first playthrough. Carlos, I've reached the main avenue. Which way do I go? See a big transmission tower? That's the substation. You'll have to circle around through an alley to your right to get there. You mean the alley that's on fire? Maybe. Surely a tall drink of water like yourself can put out a few flames. Oh my goodness. Fuck you. I'm literally gonna get that water hose just to quench your thirst, Carlos. Gotta put this out. Oh, it's sad. It's fine, I just show. I guess I didn't need to. Yeah. Put the back there, little bobblehead. Okay. Oh, here they come! <laughs> I don't know what just pushing that one's like, what if I climb it? Look at you losers. You didn't know that Raccoon City, right before this happened, was put out your explosive barrel day. And it's come early for some of you. I have to have this thing that I just have to grab it. Even though I don't care, I just need to grab it. Dance for me! Hey, you just go with the air. And you're back to the greatest place on the planet Moon Donuts. And in here we go. 
to wait for that and Tada! <gasps> they moved it! There's no longer the the bolt cutters there. Just, I, I already knew, like I said. Uh re record. It's good though. It's honestly replaying it is still fun. My only uh complaint like I don't know. Like I'm really enjoying the game still a lot. It's just playing like I don't know, I feel a little bad, like I just feel like maybe the Resident Evil 2 one was better. I mean, nothing beats the RU1 remake. That's still, like, the best. I just want games like that again. I want to come here and click this and, like, it seems dirty. Hmm, someone hasn't done dishes in a while. Something like that, you know? I feel like Luigi's been here. But, alright, this is the end of the first playthrough. Uh, second one, like I said, that one's going to be my actual first start. Like, I'm not re-recording the whole thing. Because I actually got pretty far. And I kind of want to see the rest of the game. And the kind of timely matter. But, you know, I felt like this wasn't too bad to re-record. At least it was just the first section. It's kind of just straightforward. But, alright. Thanks for watching. See ya.